All right, well, she fancies herself a well-rounded mixed martial artist, and she certainly is that. But the conversation begins with her hands. You can argue she is one of the best boxers to cross into mixed martial arts, really, in the last five to ten years. Well, she is. She's very good at what she does, and she knows that. And she'll tell you that, hey, I'm going to box your brains up. You're gonna, my jab will be in your face the entire night. You have to stop it. You say you're gonna take me down, get past my footwork. She does everything so well that it's hard to really figure out a path to beat this young lady. She's tremendous. I'm a massive fan, and I cannot wait until this fight starts. And her opponent obviously has some grappling chops. We'll see if she can try to impose her will on the decorated boxer here at a big spot tonight. Well, she developed a pretty good fan base on the jiu-jitsu circuit, and she's had some UFC success, largely due to her grappling. We'll see how she proceeds here tonight. Yeah, she's a tremendous grappler. I love watching her, because I love watching how calm she is when the fight hits the floor. She never seems to panic. You can always see her processing move from one to move two to move three, whether it's getting back to her feet or trying to pull you further into those engagements. She does it at a extremely high level, and she's very fun to watch. Some have compared her to Mackenzie Dern, perhaps a little bit of a stretch, but there is no denying all of the skills and all of the layers to her jiu-jitsu game. We'll see if she can get it going tonight. All right, with that, the weight ends here. Both fighters have placed the octagon, and we are raring to go from a sold-out Anyhow Arena here in Abu Dhabi, UAE. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. All right, we send it back inside the octagon. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Free for this ready. one. Ready. All right, round one of this stand-up only fight is underway. A friendly reminder of the rules set. Not a whole lot of them, but you can't grapple or wrestle at all. And if the fight does hit the canvas, no follow-up strikes permitted on the ground. Oh, nice hook. Keep your head moving. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, how technical is that? Nice straight punch. Right on the button. Nice job by her there to block that shot. All right, so about one minute into this fight, and if you're trying to bring new fans to the game, you're not showing them this one. This won't get it done. <laughs> These two young ladies are dancing around this is not a dance competition, it's a fight. Somebody needs to go forward and start turning this into a fight. There you go. Nice punch there. Oh, that was a huge strike right there, DC. Great shot landed. Now she's got to go chase her down and get another one off to finish the fight. Big knee there to the chest. She's going back to that patented straight right hand, unable to connect. Oh, nice investment with the kick to the body. Went for the inside leg kick. Just over two minutes to go. Oh, beautiful straight right hand. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Oh! 
Well, she's got a good front kick and certainly put it to good use there. She really understands base management, and she uses that front kick as if she's doing a jab. Oh, another one. Good knee to the body. Oh, she's just turned back. She's getting up. Yep. Man, she's hurt her opponent several times in this round. We acknowledge the durability on the other side, but how about just getting aggressive and finishing this fight? You know, she doesn't take many chances inside the octagon. Right now is a time where she should take chances. She should be going forward, putting a lot of activity out there, and trying to end her opponent's fight. Oh! Well, she gets back up here, but she is on wobbly legs. Final seconds. Oh! And that will do it! Holy smokes! We send it inside now to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 55 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alexa Grasso. So the Guadalajaran gangster Alexa Grasso getting it done by knockout here tonight. And for a while, she was out pointing people and pretty convincingly, nice to have a finish in one of that magnitude. As the confidence grows, you're going to see Alexa Grasso do more and more of this. She possesses all the skills in order to have these types of performances. Tonight, she put on paper exactly what she intended to.